For those of you that don't know, I live with my buddy, his wife, and two kids. And the other night, his two-year-old got into the sink. And luckily, he didn't mess around with any of the chemicals. He just took the soap and poured it all over the kitchen floor. But um, we didn't want that to happen again. And so after going to the hardware store and not seeing something for their knob setup, I decided, hey, I could probably 3D print something. And this will be a good practical use of 3D printing. So I went ahead and checked out the knobs and the dimensions. I kind of had an idea in my head of what I wanted to do. So I got my calipers, measured the distance between the two knobs, and after that I set out to my 3D modeling software. Basically I was going to um, kind of zip tie the 3D print um, through some holes I made onto one side and then have it where it would just snap on and snap off of the other knob. Um, I did a really, really quick, it was probably like a 10 to 15 minute model. I really should have spent more time on it. Um, I was just working on a few other things and um, thought that I'd be able to just get it on my first try. Uh, but basically after 3D printing it the first time, I was far off from what I wanted to do and my friend needed it, you know, now, not later. So I set off to Thingiverse and luckily there are so many awesome models on Thingiverse and somebody had modeled something that was a really, really cool design um, and it looked perfect for the application that I needed. So I went ahead and printed it out on my Monoprice Mini at about 30 or 40% infill. Um, I probably could have done a little bit stronger, but it is still a pretty sturdy object. And I uh, sliced it all up and printed it out. And 15 minutes later, we had a knob or a locking mechanism on the cabinet that was definitely good enough to keep him out and a deterrent which is what we wanted so um, I thought this would be a really cool idea to show you guys um, I really enjoy showing practical applications of 3d printing because most people think that it's just for doodads and can you actually print useful things with a 3d printer and this is one of those cases so anyways I thought I'd share it with you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below and let me know what your favorite practical item that you've 3d printed is I'm curious to see what other stuff you guys have printed that's not just a little doodad or something like that but actually a useful tool anyways guys as always thanks for watching don't forget to smack the like button and I will see you in my next video this has been Daniel from Modbot and I am out peace guys